Good afternoon and welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. Let's begin with Jason Laney, who has the forecast. All right, we are tracking yet another storm headed for the land of enchantment. This one's taking more of a southern route. I guess that's the more scenic route as far as this one's concerned because that's exactly where it's going. And while we're expecting most of the snow and heavier rains to stay south, there will be an influence of this storm even in the northern reaches of the state, although precipitation obviously a lot lighter in those areas. By the time we get into late Thursday afternoon, so long to the storm. Possibly hello to a pretty good looking weekend ahead. Albuquerque police are investigating an apparent homicide. A newspaper delivery person found the victim's body in the street near the corner of Georgia and Catherine Southeast early this morning. The man was African American, a male, and again, he had suffered trauma. That trauma was to his neck. Officers have gone from door to door trying to get information from neighbors. Some residents told police that they heard gunshots last night, but investigators haven't said if that's related to this case. On this date 20 years ago, a crime took place that still haunts New Mexico today, the Las Cruces Bowling Alley Massacre. Seven people were shot execution style. Four of them died. Police know there were two killers, but despite thousands of leads, the gunmen have not been caught. If you have any information about these brutal murders, call Las Cruces Police. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates throughout the day.